So about a few days later after my female Snow Godzilla said yes to Mae Godzilla that she will marry him. Um She basically like the wedding began. And of course, May if you want to know Godzilla officially became May Godzilla's wife. And about a few weeks later. Anyway, sorry about that. Um, like I said before, um, many female Snow Godzilla about a few weeks later, she got pregnant. Both her and Maya Godzilla were extremely happy for the past two long night. Yeah. When many female Snow Godzilla first lay eggs, there was originally 20 eggs. But one night, about the first week of her being nest bound, as she could not leave the nest while Maya Godzilla did basically all the hunting. But they do take tur but they did take turns. They did take turns on watching over the nest. Um Ugh. But one night, as May Godzilla and Mayfield Snow Godzilla were sleeping, a man skull crawler actually came in to their nest and ate. Anyways, um, the man skull crawler, <laughs> he ate, um, Twelve of the eggs, only leaving eight left. When Man Godzilla woke up, he got so mad, he literally kind of cut open the Man Skull Crawler and ate him alive. Man from Snow Godzilla was instantly overprotective. She did not want to leave her nest. She did not want to be anywhere away from her offspring. She was just a very overprotective mother. And you could say Maya Godzilla was like the same way as his wife. <clears throat> but all their efforts paid off. About two months later, their eggs finally hatched. Now, for Maya female Snow Godzilla's offspring, we have Maya Plasma Goji, which is her firstborn son. Um, Maya Shadow Goji, her firstborn daughter. Maya Godzilla Jr. Maya Nightmare Goji. Maya Lava Goji. This, I've kind of forgot to mention in the previous Kaiju profile. And it is Maya Fire Goji. So. Yeah. Um, Maya... Maya Drago Goji and Maya Water Goji. So, Maya Female Snow Godzilla has eight kids. Um, now, moving on to her allies. Her allies are Maya Zilla. May King Ghidorah. Um, her grandfather in law. Um, May Godzilla twenty eighteen. May Angiris, May Fire, May Legendary Rodan, May Angiris. Yeah. All of May Godzilla 2018's friends. So, 
And I kind of forgot who her arch enemy was. Super Burn and Godzilla, I think you were the one who came up with the arch enemy. So can you remind me who her arch enemy was? So, yeah. So, that's it for Man and Female Snow Godzilla. Oh, wait, never mind. There's her abilities. I forgot. I forgot about her abilities. Um, sorry about that. Anyways, um, she does have an atomic breath like all Godzillas do. Except her atomic breath is blue, purple. Her atomic breath is blue, but with a yellow and purple ray around it. Um, like Snow Godzilla, she can cause a snowstorm to happen. Except her snowstorm is like 50 times more dangerous and more um, powerful. She does use ice magic like a ice wizard would do, actually. <clears throat> and she also has a nuclear pulse. And well, she clearly has no burning form. And I think um, I think her last ability is, of course, um, Ice Volcano. If you're wondering what type of, if you're wondering how can she use that ability, it's very simple. She just fires her tongue breath at the ground and then concentrate the power the pure power of the atomic breath and with with a lot of luck on her side she can actually turn her atomic breath and make it kind of turn turn it into Um, she actually can turn her power and her atomic breath into a volcano. Wondering what does it do? It does a crap ton of damage to her opponents. And also, it would take away half of her opponent's energy. And also give them a very severe brain freeze. And also a new ability called Frozen Heart. Now this ability is kind of dangerous because her she can literally froze her opponent's heartbeat. Make it go a little slower than it is. And... Well, she can actually use that ability to, if she like clenches her hands very fast and very tightly, she can actually make um, the heart of her opponent like instantly like poof, like not disappear, but like she can actually make it have a lot of spikes come out straight from the heart. Coming out straight out of the heart. Killing her opponent from the inside. Without even doing anything. So, if you are wanting to fight Mayfield Snow Godzilla, 
Good luck. And that's if Man Godzilla's not after you. Because, I think it's like what I said before in the previous video, Man Godzilla is extremely overprotective of his friends and family members. He's especially overprotective of his wife. So, yeah. Anyways, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Like, comment, subscribe, and I will see you all in the next video. So, yeah. Peace out.